fire the cannons. Thousands of fans packed into Ray J. See the Bucks kick off on home turf. And 10 Tampa Bay's Angelicia Bruton was there for today's big win and spoke to tailgating fans who hope this is a good omen for the rest of the season. Fans are partying in the stands and outside the stadium as well. I asked multiple Bucks fans what they're looking forward to this season, and they all say winning. And the Bucks did just that. Our first party is the tailgate, and our second party is in the stadium. Michael Simonick says he's been tailgating outside of the Raymond James Stadium for the last decade. Each year, people come in and give us stuff and donate everything, and usually it's sentimental value. Over the years, he says he's met people from all over the world. Happy birthday to and some have become friends. Oh, these guys are tailgates that we've met throughout the years and they've stuck with us. Fans like Christian Larson says there's no other crew they would want to be a part of. I'm born and raised here, you know, I grew up watching the Bucks with my dad for since I was can remember, you know, it's just in our blood. Larson is a season ticket holder, and to start off the season, he brought his cousin Joe Coxum to his first Bucks game. I left for the military right out of high school, and I just recently moved back. This season opener isn't just special to Coxum, but Parker Schmidt as well. I wanted to go Bucks color, so I got the hat and the shirt and then the black shorts to kind of go with it. Schmidt says she usually watches the game at home, but this year they're starting the season off differently. I'm looking forward to probably getting to see how it plays out, not on a TV, more like actually seeing it in person. The electric atmosphere surrounded Schmidt and her family as the Bucks came out on top. It's just nice to be a Buccaneer. Angelicia Bruton. Go Bucks! 10 Tampa Bay.